mom said, please say it ain't so. Say it ain't so. She just forgave you last year almost to the date that you pulled this same stunt with Summer Buddy, though. Almost to the date. I will say you couldn't even go a whole year without trying to get your little thing waxed on, waxed off. Lil Nasty. I said nickname is Lil Nasty. Lil Nasty have struck again. Hello guys, this is Spilling the Messy Truth, and I am your host, Tasha Talk Truth. Mm-hmm, the name has changed. The name has changed. So let's get straight into it. All right, I'm set it up for discussion, and Cardi B's up for discussion. I'm set, say it ain't so, brother. Say it ain't so, little nasty. You know what? After this, I have to give, uh, I'll set a nickname. Little Nasty, that's his name, Little Nasty, Little Nasty, Little Nasty. Okay? I'm set, it's still DMing these girls after he didn't beg his wife for forgiveness and to take him back because he wanted to spend. Um, I only got one birthday wish, and that's to get my, my, my wife back, Cardi. You know what I'm saying? We're going through a lot of things right now, a lot of things on the media. I want to apologize to you, Cardi. You know, I embarrassed you. I made you look crazy. Doing things I ain't had no business. I was partaking in activity that I shouldn't have been taking in. And I apologize, you know what I'm saying? Breaking your heart, breaking our promise, breaking God's promise, and and being a, a, a selfish, messed up husband, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to I'm I'm trying to be a better person. I wanna get this off my shoulders, I wanna get this off my back. I apologize to you, Cardi. I love you and culture. I wanna spend Christmas with you. It looks like Offset may not be spending this Christmas with his family, okay? Now I want to say this, so I'm set. Little nasty, you ain't learned your lesson after you done begged the woman back. It was to the date. It was to the date. Cardi B announced her divorce last year, December the 5th, 2018. It's almost to the date. You couldn't go a whole year. You couldn't, you just couldn't make it off there, could you? You just couldn't make it. Lil Nasty just couldn't make it. All right, guys, Summer everything in this video is a lead. Cuban doll in M4 situation happened when Cardi B announced on her Instagram that she was getting divorced. Check it out. Things just haven't been working out between us for a long time, and it's nobody's fault. It's just like, I guess we grew out of love but we're not together anymore i don't know it might take time to get a divorce say it ain't so i said say it ain't so no <laughs> allegedly offset has been sliding into jay dms now if nobody know who jade is let me back the story up just a little bit before i get started okay Jade and Betty G, they're allegedly their sisters, and they used to work at a nightclub called Angels. Now, for the people that don't know, Jade and Cardi B have beef with each other. Actually, Cardi B on facing criminal charges for ordering or for ordering an attack on Jade and her sister Betty G. Allegedly. Yes. The Migos did a concert in New York. And they went to a club called Angels, Angels Nightclub. And Betty G and Jay are bartenders, and they used to work there. But they end up getting ran out of the club because allegedly Cardi B had goons to go and try to attack them. Allegedly, okay? So Betty G and her sister Jay working at this nightclub. I'll set the Migos, they are up there. And I guess somebody knows Cardi B hit her up and said, look, these two bartenders are a little bit too friendly with Offset. You probably need to get up here. And Cardi B told that nanny to watch culture, baby culture, because culture was a baby back then. Watch baby culture. Cardi B called up her friends, allegedly, meet me up here at this club. Cardi B jumped in that Uber. Hair all mangled, twisted. She threw a hat on, flew on up there. 
Cardi B head was a mess. Girls, y'all know how it is when our men, uh, somebody call us and tell us our men somewhere they ain't got no business to be. Girl, we gonna jump out that bed with one shoe on, a knife in our back pocket, and hair all over our head. We are on our way, and that's exactly what Cardi B does. So, when they get up in the club or whatever, um, allegedly again, so Cardi B came on up to the nightclub. Cardi B ordered an attack on Jade and Jade's sister, which was Black Lip Remy. I have to call her Black Lip Remy so people can know who I'm talking about because Tasha K gave her that nickname. Okay, now I know my lips are dark, but hell, I had to say what I had to say so people can understand who she is, Black Lip Remy. But Cardi B is the one who actually got locked up and actually is in criminal court right now and the young lady is jade which jade is six nine's wife yeah girlfriend wife allegedly they were supposed to have gotten married she have a six nine tattoo on her shoulder and she got a tattoo of his face on her other shoulder now i'm said was in the same predicament last year i mean to the date almost to the date december the 5th 2018 offset was caught on camera by summer bunny summer bunny exposed his butt now hold on to that thought about summer bunny because it's very interesting about the dms jade posted to her instagram story where offset allegedly jumped in her dms and said this Jay took her Instagram and she put Offset ass on blast, okay? Your wife, I am a Cardi B, has a criminal case. Why are you writing me? You don't respect her? Nope. There's a lot of shit I haven't exposed yet, but there's a time for that. I'm the queen of talking shit now. I'm bagging it up. Oh. <laughs> Imagine fighting cases for a nigga and he still missed the bitch. So the hack started after you got exposed. Why it didn't start at 1 a.m.? Little Nasty apparently DM Jay and Jay responded back like, Look, why are you DMing me knowing I got a court case with your wife? What's up with you? I ain't trying to mess with you. See, I said, don't nobody want you, okay? Nobody want you. Nobody want you, okay? Summer Buddy didn't even want you, okay? She, she out of your ass out. She didn't even want you. Now, it's mighty funny that Offset claims that he was hacked, but Jay did post proof. You couldn't have been hacked because it's mighty funny that you were hacked right after you were exposed. Mm -hmm. The fact that me and Offset just woke up, I know y'all saw that I put earlier that we broke night. Miss Latavia's mom. Hey, Miss Tav. Hey, y'all. She just I woke us I, up because it's like, oh my gosh, what the hell? I can't open i can't change anything here it's okay it's nothing like i got right. this should happen to me before maybe just relax okay hey guys so as you can see this guy instagram has been had now let me tell y'all something my bad we just we look crazy we just woke up like we've been sick throughout the whole damn night this boy got a cold i have like a very crazy stomach ache I, i'm about to go to the hospital because i i feel like it's food poisoning but anyways you know, I know, I, babe, I know you done some dumb shit. I know he done, we, everybody know he done some dumb shit. But come on, niggas ain't dumb. Niggas ain't crazy. We've been so good. We had, we had a sweet weekend. So someone posted from Little Nasty account some other funky and little then tip. there was some weird tweets that was going on saying that he was gay and he liked booty cheeks and things like that, you know. <sighs> That's not the M.O. of a hacker. I've been seeing hackers get into accounts and give out information. I mean, just DM all kinds of people, uh, say racist things to people. I mean, I've seen a hacker go in, okay? Go in. But what was funny about the hacker 
that DM Jay, but not Summer Bunny. Now, when you think he would have DM Summer Bunny before Jay, but <clears throat> let's just think if this was offset, he sure wouldn't have DM Summer Bunny because Summer Bunny exposed his ass last year around this time. So, put two and two together. That looked like a woman had done it. I don't think a man, even though Offset, if he was caught up, I don't even think he still would have put that out there about himself. That's something that a female would have done to cover up something. Yeah, let me put something gay. Let me put something out here so it can really look like it was a hacker. And then, ain't it strange that Cardi B didn't snap? Now, we know this girl is known for jumping on her IG live and going the hell off. Uh-uh, she didn't do that. You know what she did? She was really, really calm, just like she was when she announced her divorce from Offset. Yeah, I went to, to talk to, and we got a lot of love for each other, but things just haven't been working out between us for a long time, and it's nobody's fault. It's just like, I guess we grew out of love, but we're not together anymore. Come on Instagram Live, and she's talking, and she's trying to, you know, get the, everything figured out. Offset Mom is there, and Cardi B is like, Offset Mom came and, you know, told me this. And it's like, oh, baby, it's okay. Now, I know he does some things. I know he does some things, but mm -mm, this ain't it. This ain't it. Oh, I'm sick. I, I'm sick. He look baby sick. No, she said, this boy, this boy, this boy's sick. And I think I may go to the hospital. Yeah, Cardi B, you're on your way to the hospital because you're about to have a nervous damn breakdown, okay? You're trying to keep your cool, okay? So you don't want the whole world to find out that your husband, the one that begged you back and the one that you took back, then jumped in the girl's DMs knowing you got a court case with the girl. Mm, mm, you know, mm, I'm, mm. I feel sorry for Cardi B. I really do. I really do. I really do. I really do. I feel sorry for her. She don't deserve this. No woman deserves this. Cardi B is still in court right now to this day fighting a case against these women. Now, if Offset is the one who sent this tweet, this text to Jay, he should be ashamed of himself. Let me get really serious now. He should be ashamed of himself because one thing I will say about Cardi B, Cardi B has been a faithful, good wife to Offset. I cannot take that away from her, okay? Yes, yeah, she do silly stuff. Yes, yeah, she gets on, you know, she, she pisses people off. She do do that, but she has been a damn woman and a good wife and a good mother. <clears throat> well, she ain't drinking um, <clears throat> with the baby. Offset, if you if you done this, Offset, you should be ashamed of yourself. And I hope Cardi B leave you and never come back. So, that's pretty much what is going on. So, Offset um, DM Jay and said, I miss you, for real. FR. But he didn't. The, the, then he said he was hacked. But then Cardi B goes to her Instagram Live. And she's uh, calm and saying things like, I know what's going on. I know what y'all thinking. But he ain't did this. He ain't did that. You know, covering up. Covering up. Cover up. Cover up. And that's so funny. Last time that Offset got caught cheating in front of the, the front of everybody, Cardi B was just as calm when she announced her divorce, just like she's just as calm in this video. Like, I got right. this shit happened to me before. Here, just relax. Okay. Hey guys. So as you can see, this guy Instagram has been hacked. Anyways, you know. I know, I, babe, I know you done some dumb shit. I know he done, we, everybody know he done some dumb shit. But come on, now. niggas ain't dumb. Niggas ain't crazy. We've been so good. We had, we had a sweet weekend. Um, life has been good. Now, I just think that's strange because we all know Cardi B. Cardi B would have took to that Instagram and she would have snapped, clapped, I mean, would have exploded if this wasn't true. And if he was really hacked, she would have definitely went off on Batty G. She could have actually said that she was being harassed by the lady, knowing that they have a court case open. She could have said, she's, she's harassing my husband. But no, mm -mm, Cardi B ain't talking like that. Because allegedly, it must be true. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, it must be true. So guys, let me know what y'all think. Leave 
a comment. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. Spilling the messy truth with Tasha Talk Truth.